my Turk, I, I score five different ways. I, I can go all day long and tear this guy apart. Okay? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do a good Turk, and then he's going to go all out. I can't let him do that. So when he bellies down, like when we belly down, instead of staying square, because he knows if he does that, I'm going to Turk him and take him over, he's going to feed that hip down to try to stop me. See how I'm rotating my hip? Bottom guys, you got to do this for your opponent or for the top guy. Okay, so you turk him once, he's like, oh my goodness, that was so strong. As soon as he gets to his belly, he's going to do this. Just try to stop the turk. Okay. So we all know the turk. I'll do it again real quick though. I get in, whatever, we break down flat. I get here, I figure four, arch, rotate, cup the head. I try to get my pin, but he bellies down maybe. You get here, and now he's going to try to hit down to stop the turk. See how I came back and off of them? Instead of staying here, I'm coming back. I'm just going to start working my power half, <coughs> grabbing it, and taking it over. Okay? If you work it good and quick, you'll get it. Okay? If Coach, see how Coach brought his arm in? He's pretty experienced. He's not going to let me dig that half, right? So if I let him get to his base and I wait to do the half, he's going to ball up and he's going to, he's going to stop me. Okay? So we want to get it right as he's bellying down. And we go here, he's bellying down, boom, I'm getting here before he brings his elbow in. Okay, and see how I came off his hips? I'm not arched, I'm on my knees. I come back and I get to my power half right away. Okay, same thing. Use my back foot to drive, hugging this tight to my chest, just bringing him over. Getting my, my near fall again. So I got three near fall for my Turk. I'm getting three near fall for my power half. And now I'm going to look for a pin because this guy's let me do whatever I want to him at this point, right? So turn him this way a little bit. For my half, right here. See how I'm laying on my shoulder? I want to come up and bring my elbow to my side here. When I do that, I bring this half nice and tight across his neck. Okay, so I'm here, I come up, and I got a nice half right here. I don't want to put the palm of my hand on his head. Some people teach that way. I want to turn my hand sideways like a karate chop. Karate chop across the back of his neck. He tries to belly down here, he can't. Okay? And I'm not using much strength, right? It's just my bone. He'd have to break my forearm to belly down. Not gonna happen, nobody's that strong, all right? So I'm here, I kind of bring my chest up. See, I pull my elbow underneath me. That helps me get my half nice and deep, okay? Then what I'm gonna do is let go of my figure four. And I'm gonna kick over, I'm gonna put my forehead on the mat up here, okay? See his arms? Both of his arms are trapped above his head. I always teach my guys, that if he can bring his elbows to his side, you'll never get a pin. If the guy's elbows are above his head, you pin him really easy. That's almost any pinning combination. If his elbow is above his head here, you're gonna get a pin. If he can bring his elbows down, you're probably not gonna pin him. Okay? So legs in, let me throw my leg back in. Here, power half him over. I'm going to bring my elbow in, sink my half nice and deep, karate chop the back of his neck. I let go of my figure four, kick over, and my head goes right here. See how I'm tripoding over top of him? All my weight is on his, right in his armpit, in his shoulders. Okay? He can't belly down right here. I got him. What I'm going to do is lift my feet, rotate him over. Lift my feet, rotate him over, and I'm going to slide back. I'm going to arch, keep my head and chest up. Slowly slide down, and I sink the half nice and deep, and I can run him over. Okay. So I want you to break him down, get your Turk. When he bellies down, I want you to force that uh, Turk hip down. Then he's going to power half you over and get the pin. All right. Thigh pry, leg in, boom, I'm extending him, boom, I get the Turk. Here, he bellies down. I'm going right to a power half and bring him over right away. <coughs> Once I get here, suck the elbow in, get it deep, kick over. I need my head to go on the mat up here. I lift my toes, rotate, slowly slide back, sink it deep, and I walk him over. When I walk him over, what did I say about his elbows? If they're above his head, I'm going to get a pin, right? Where are his elbows right now? Right, I got this one blocked, right? He can't bring that one down. He can bring his other arm down. They try to stop me, block my legs. If he'll bring his arm down, post on my legs, 
try to stop me, I want to kick it out, replace it, and trap it. So I trap both of his arms over his head, now I'm going to get a pin. If he can bring his arm down and post on my leg, I'm not going to be able to run him over, I'll get my gear fall, but I won't get my pin. And then boom, kick that leg out, trap it up, post, get a pin. All right, question? Anybody got questions? Let's try it.